is Lunar Rebirth a dead game? Well, today we're going to jump back into Lunar Rebirth and take a look why this game may be dying. Hello all, my name's Daniel and welcome to Twisted Geek. Now we're going to fire up Lunar Rebirth and take a look and I'll show you some of the areas that appears that the game itself may be dying. So I've been playing Lunar Rebirth for about five or six months now, maybe a little bit longer. And I'll show you straight away why on the server that I'm on, server 17, why this to me, the game is actually dying. Not too long ago as well, servers 1 through 10 were merged together just due to the lack of players on them servers. So what you'll see if we go straight over here onto the Guild War section, you'll notice that there is only my guild in there, nothing else. And essentially only me active in that guild. I have an alternative player as well, character, Zangetti there, who just kind of helps not just boost that up, but just keep like the pets in, in place. And it's just another person to help us in like the expedition. In fact, I can like rely on that other account to actually help me out with the expedition. But that itself is essentially dead. There's like just every week now, it's just a case of I'll go on on a Saturday morning and there it is, I am cut, I'm done. Then you go into the dojo as well. Again, it is only me in the dojo. Every so often I put Sangetti in there, but other than that, there's no one else which has been in this, dun this dojo for months now. This can also be made more apparent if we go into the, not the trial tower, sorry. Actually, yeah, I can show you here in the trial tower. And if I go to leaderboard, you'll see on the leaderboard there, I am of course ahead at the moment. Uh, which was the last time I pushed on that was the second of the second. I've been stuck on this one for a little while, but I've not really tried to push it further. Uh, and the person before that was back in December. Uh, Alpha Nox there that has actually done a little bit more previously, but everyone else you see is all in 2023. So there's no one else on there. It's essentially on this server, it's me and Alpha Nox who actually is active on the server. And that can be seen again as well if we go over to Valhalla and go onto the leaderboard onto here. As you can see again, it looks like one person new might have actually joined this, someone called, who's just got novice, I haven't actually put a full name on yet. So that might be someone new who's just level 23, but I've never seen that anywhere else, they've got no points in here, so they're not really hit that level yet to get into this part of it, or they're just not really bothered found that the game is not for them, because this, this particular server is, it is dead. There is one other area we can actually look at and actually explain why this is more as it is, and more dead, is if I go over to Discord, and we go into the giveaway area bot. You can see at the moment there's 37 people participating into this. When this was really busy, this was in like the hundreds. There was loads of people participating in this. And now when I've been going on, I've not really bothered participating any more in this. But it, I've not seen it go past about 50 or so. Look at 37, 46, 43, look all the previous 45, 44s. So you can see it is a lot less active on the Discord as well with going to that giveaways and things like that. Again, if I go to the side, I've not been here for a little while, but you'll see there's not a lot of chat. There's bits of chat here and there. But this used to be absolutely rammed constantly with loads of messages that I couldn't actually keep up on at all. So one of the main reasons is for this as well, if I go back out of here, we go into the server. So I'm going to go into here, which we'll switch to servers, go to server one. And I've not been on here since the merge, so I don't know if um, this is now seeming a lot more active now. But we'll jump on and see how this looks. Let's get past all this because it's been a little while been on. Yes, uh, and yes, it's fine. So we'll go to the town. And if I could just take a moment right here and just say if you are liking these kind of game reviews, I do enjoy playing the games and reviewing these games and going over them. If you do actually like this and showing the different areas and sections of the games, please leave a comment down below or give that like button a big smash. Be greatly appreciated. Some people nine hours, four hours, two hours, so there's people who are actually active on this one. And I go into the chat. So as you can see there in the chat, there is a few more people active on this. And I think that's me down because of the server merge. Without the server merge, people seem there's only one or two people on every server. So because of that, there's now a few more in here. It's a bit more competition for people. Go to the planes, go to the world map. And we can see, yep, chapter 50, forest 100. So there is people who are further, but this is actually an old, of course, this is the old server. Server one, not people aren't onto it now. With this being said, yes, the server merge it seems definitely worked on this one, and it's a lot more people active on this now, you can see by the chat. But mainly, it is the brand new servers that are actually more active, and they keep on adding more and more servers. So if we go back into here again, go to the NA servers, as you can see, we're up to server 71. 
of course I originally started on server 17 and you got the S servers now as well which are up to 51 as well so they are constantly adding more and more servers and one of the things that you don't get as well is if we go back to my main account one thing you get on the new servers you get a lot of different events and that that's going on which don't normally hit these servers as much especially over on the idle season ones here this here this season has been over for months and months there's not been anything new here at all for a lot a lot of months so they are neglecting that in a lot of ways unfortunately so what do you think is lunar rebirth actually a dead game I've seen on the Discord server that a lot of people will actually just switch and go to other servers afterwards. But essentially you're starting from scratch each time you do that. There isn't anything that can transfer your full character over to a newer server. If there was, and it was at a decent price, I think that would be very beneficial. And it would bring some more joy back to the game a little bit. A lot more stuff to do. If you could also jump from, I don't know like say, my server 17 to server 50. I wouldn't accept to go right to the brand new servers because that would put you super far ahead of everyone else. Uh, which is a little bit unfair on them but somewhere kind of in between would be quite cool but my name's been daniel this has been twisted geek hope you have an awesome week cheers